what's up guys this is Daimonic and welcome to another episode of the Red Moon Crypto Show the show we talk about cryptocurrency investing crypto games all money conversation you know because we we need money we need to we, guys we need to get powerful we need to level up anyway let's get let's get to it so in the previous video I spoke about how Bitcoin is currently in a position where I really believe that we are overheated and we need a time to we need a little a little two months to just to breathe and cool down because everything is just popping 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 and real quick let's let's see something very interesting currently are we on alt season or are we on BTC season and according to uh, blockchain blockchain center we are currently in mm, Bitcoin season. Now, if you if you've been in the cryptocurrency space for for uh, over a year, you know that bear markets are usually Bitcoin markets and bull markets are usually altcoin markets. Currently, we are sort of in, in a bear market because if we come down here to the charts, and, and this is the BTC versus USD on Coinbase, we we can say that following this. Uh, red line right here, which is a resistance, a previous resistance at 64k in these levels right here and here. This this was our resistance pushing pushing the price uh, lower. Now, what can happen here? Two things. We either come over here, hit this top of the line, come down here, down come down here to retest the, this resistance flip support. And then we go all the way up to 50, 60, 70, 100 K per Bitcoin. That's option A. Very optimistic, not really realistic and not really taking into consideration the fact that the amount of money required for Bitcoin to reach 100 uh, it, K, it's a tremendous amount of money. And right now we don't have the momentum to take Bitcoin to 100 K before the end of the year. It's just the, the amount is in the billions. It, it's, it's impossible. I mean, nothing's impossible, but this, this right thing, this right here, I don't think is going to happen. But um, option B, option B, uh, option B is more conservative is, yeah, right now we are currently at um, 51K. Let's say Bitcoin came up here, got rejected at this level, came down here to uh, retest this uh, resistance flip support, doesn't hold it, comes down here doesn't hold this resistant fifth support comes down here to the absolute bottom and then from this point on we are in a bull trend to 100k but mm, we reached the bottom by november maybe end of september what i'm proposing right here is the understanding that we might have we might have this month be a correction month the month of september and, and this is how, this is why I believe that. Uh, and this is the BLX, by the way, guys. If you look at the BLX, the, the Brave New Coin Liquid Index, and this is the monthly, by the way, which means each, each candle is uh, one month. You can see that starting in October of the last year, we had six green candles, a massive six green candles, which took Bitcoin basically all the way to 500%. A 5x on the price of Bitcoin is it's really really good and then we had three months correction where Bitcoin loses basically 55% so we had a 55% correction after basically a 5x a 6x actually so so now we have three green candles after the three red candles we've put three green candles to give us a, a pump of you know more or less 76 percent so this is a 76 percent recovery to the upside now you either believe that bitcoin is just going to go on a row and just keeps going up or you think that we're going to have a little correction maybe two three maybe two red candles and come over here and then carry on going up i personally believe in the second case i think a correction is very healthy and gives us a lot of opportunity to make a lot of money because this is we make money in corrections this is how we make our money we don't make money when the market is exploding and everybody is buying altcoins and everything is going up no 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 bear markets are the best opportunities to make money so 
when you when you take in consideration that Bitcoin might indeed have a correction, a couple of questions um, come to mind. What do you do with your capital? Do you take profits? Do you put it to work? What can you do with your money to take full advantage of scenarios like this? When when the price of Bitcoin will have a correction, probably 40, probably 30 percent. And you're thinking, how can I capitalize and, and actually get in on that action when Bitcoin has these crashes? So um, one of the things I advise a lot of people to do is to start using the blockchain, start using blockchain protocols. Like, for example, uh, I'm going to pull up Aave. Uh, and this is Aave on the Polygon chain. Now, if you look at if you look at Ave right here, I have currently in this protocol roughly twenty twenty thousand dollars, which is forty percent of Bitcoin, parking over here, and I'm basically taking a leverage of seven k on my Bitcoin. Now, in a protocol like Ave, in the Polygon chain, it's so cheap. The, the, the transaction fees for Polygon are so cheap that they allows you to take a tremendous amount of leverage taking loans against your Bitcoin free so you can buy altcoins or you can buy Bitcoin or you can just put that money in a yield farm and earning a tremendous amount of yield. Um, this is what yield farmers like guys like us, like me and you, you know, because you're going to become a yield farmer as well. Um, this is this is how people like us make tremendous amount of money in the blockchain space. Now, uh, some of the yields right now, as you, as you can see, they're pretty bad. And if you compare the, the yields on, on Polygon versus the yield on BlockFi, you're going to see that the yields on BlockFi are, are much, 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 much better. Because you, you, you can see that you're getting, what, um, a 0.41% on your Bitcoin on an APY annual percentage income. You're getting 40%. That's, well, well 0.41%. That's less than 1%. That's ridiculous. But... Obviously, the liquidity mining program on uh, Polygon is, is, is long been gone, so you're not going to make a lot of money with Polygon. But if you jump on some of the newest blockchains, like, for example, Avalanche, you're going to find some a different level of opportunity. And if you allow me... Sorry, guys. Internet's a bit slow. And here we go. So on Avalanche, currently Avalanche is running a liquidity money program that basically allows you to get paid to take on loans. They are paying you to take on loans. Sounds like a no-brainer, no? Money, money, free money. Everybody likes free money. Good. So there's a couple of blockchains that are doing, doing that at the moment. Polygon was doing it first, and then Terra, Terra Luna did it after, and now it's Avalanche. And you can bet your sweet ass then when Cardano and when Pol um, Polkadot release their DeFi protocols, that they're going to have liquidity mining programs in place. So the best thing you can do right now is to take advantage of the liquidity mining programs that are available now so you can learn how to hustle uh, free money on the blockchain before the real deal comes in. So... As you can see in the Avalanche um, protocol, you're getting paid roughly 6.55 on Avalanche, 7.87% um, uh, on your DAI. Uh, I think the most amount of money you can get on this is, is basically 13%, 14% on your USDT, on your Tether. And in my, in my Aave account, I roughly have 40, well, 51, 55, 55K on on Binky, which is which is generating me a, a significant amount of yield. It's not not too much, but basically a net APY of five percent on on fifty k. So five percent on fifty k is it's not that bad. Five percent APY on fifty thousand dollars. That's not that bad. I'll take that any day. You know, I don't like to work. So free money, passive income, passive income, please. Active income, no active income. Passive income. Yes, portfolio income. Yes, active income. I can't. I can't show my middle finger. You know, I can't show my middle finger right here. That's 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 active income for you guys. I want to get. I want to get paid for mostly passive income and portfolio income because I'm gonna be in the one percent. Active income. That's for you peons, man. That's for you. So yeah, guys. Um, 
There are many opportunities in the blockchain right now that will allow you to make a tremendous amount of passive income by using the blockchain, basically. Um, Anchor is another uh, protocol that'll, that'll give you a lot of money. This is this is on a Terra chain. Now, if I show you the, the kind of rewards that you can get on Anchor, they're pretty decent. Number one, you get basically 20% APY on your dollars if let's go to earn okay so you get basically 19 percent apy on your dollars so as you can see i've deposited a thousand and six hundred dollars not a lot but yeah uh, obviously i have my i have a couple of luna over here yeah about roughly 10 11 luna and one ethereum on on um anchor and and that's gonna that's gonna give me some passive income, which then I'll compound it to getting even more passive income. So this is the thing: yield farming is basically taking money and putting in another protocol protocol that gives you a, a, a bigger yield. So the twenty percent APY on the dollars that I get, I usually take them out and I deposit them in in something like um, an ANC uh, slash UST liquidity mining program that gives me forty one percent. So basically the rewards that I get over here, like for example, this is rewards of, of basically a day. So I got seven US dollars. I would take this money right here, which, which I'm gonna show you right now. Uh, let's go. So this is what I would do. I would take this money. I do take this money and and then I compound this over here for to get 41%. So the more you compound, the more you compound, the more the more money you make. Ooh, let me get some dollars. So I'm gonna go over here to earn. I'm gonna withdraw roughly $10. That's all I need and i'm going to deposit and compound and compound i keep compounding my interest in situations where bitcoin is going down you want your money to be working for you really because as as the price of crypto lowers in value your rewards are still the same you still get the same amount of rewards sometimes you get less rewards sometimes you get even more rewards but it's the opportunity to continue to purchase, 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 purchase at, at every damn level. That's how you keep your portfolio always moving up. You have to put your money to work. So um, let me just finish this, guys, and, and I'll, I'll cover the next topic. So you take that money and basically all you have to do is compound it again. You add liquidity and you flip it again. So there's a couple of blockchains, like, like I was saying before, Avalanche will, will pay you a tremendous amount right now to, to basically just to deposit your capital there. And then if you want a yield farm on that, even better. Anchor, really, well, Terra, Terra, Terra and Luna offer you a, a good deal with liquidity mining programs as well. It's still on, it's still very decent. Um, and obviously Polygon, Polygon, the liquidity mining program is not, is not worth it for, for you to be in Polygon, but it's just the fact that Polygon is still the Ethereum chain, and the, you know close proximity. It's it's so cheap as well. It, it's it's almost like a no brainer. And let me just take that, and there you go. So this is pretty much what I would do. I would just take that money, take my yield farms, and just stake it into some other protocol, and just carry on compounding my interest and interest and interest uh that's one of the reasons why let's let's go back to the polygon chain matic mainnet that's one of the reasons why i was able to basically stack a tremendous amount of this um token called ramp from ramp DeFi. So um, if you guys don't know what Rampify is, Ramp, oh my God, Ramp is a collateral token, collateralized token that allows you to basically deposit your Ramp here and you can take US dollars against your, you can mint US dollars against your portfolio. So right now you stake your Ramp to get 40% APY. 
39% APY, which is amazing. On any like blockchain token, 40% APY is, is beautiful. So, but that's not, that's not the, the, the main power of RAMP. The main power of RAMP, what makes RAMP so attractive is the fact that this is an altcoin with a hundred, with a hundred and thirty, a hundred and twenty million dollar market cap that allows you to take loans against the value of the, the crypto asset. So here's the proposition. The proposition is this. I have basically a hundred thousand of these tokens that, that equal more or less forty thousand dollars, more or less. I'm getting basically almost like a minimum wage from this, like um roughly 40 40 dollars a day something like that so i take this money and i just compound it i compound it compound it compound it now uh as you can see the token price is at 37 cents like ramp was a dollar 20 you know what i mean when ramp goes to say two dollars i'll be able to take a tremendous amount of loan money and buy all the assets you know what I mean? So RAMP is really a powerful, um, powerful, powerful blockchain, powerful DeFi application. So I think in the top, in the top, in the beginning of the video, I, I was talking about how C5 versus DeFi and which, which one is more um, profitable. Uh, I believe that there's no comparison. DeFi is infinitely more powerful because it allows you to uh, take, take on massive leverage on your assets and and, and take advantage of these early protocols that offer you liquidity mining programs and and all sorts of free money that that is is a it's ridiculous not to pass on this opportunity if you have say a thousand dollars in in any crypto asset let's say you have ethereum stick it on luna you know if you have ethereum stick it on Avalanche chain and just start getting those those yields uh because as the as a crypto asset crypto asset goes goes down with with the market you know as bitcoin goes down and, and, and touches the, this this supports at the lower levels you'll take a tremendous amount of leverage down there the opportunity for you to take advantage of this infinite amount of money it's 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 it's, it's, it's honest to god i i it's unbelievable unbelievable so yes, guys, this is the video right now. I just wanted to show you more or less what DeFi, what's the power of DeFi really. I'm going to make um, uh, a different video tomorrow and, and explain more in depth how to get into these blockchains and how to take advantage of these um, protocols. But uh, that's all for today. Uh, guys, leave your comments down below. Subscribe if you want to. And uh, that's it. Peace out.